Hey guys, um, my name is Dustin Apple, and we're out bow fishing Padoka Lake tonight. It's, uh, it's August 31st, Labor Day weekend, and it's my home lake, my favorite lake. Um, and I'm a sportsman. I I love chasing all kinds of critters, big game, small game. Um, I'm you know active on social media. I, I like I like the camaraderie among sportsmen. It's 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 what I do. It's what I love. But on occasion, um, we see a special interest group or uh, animal rights activists uh, attack us as sportsmen, as hunters. Well, you know, for for what it's worth, I, I understand. I understand your cause. You don't want to see an animal suffer. Um, but that, that's the absolute last thing that a sportsman wants to see either. Um, while we're out here fishing tonight, um, we found an uh, Indiana whitetail that's been taken by EHD. Um, if you don't know, EHD is, is a disease that um, these animals can get in the summertime, and uh, there's not really a whole lot that anybody can do about it. Um, this is a beautiful whitetail, and sadly enough, nobody gets to enjoy it. Nobody gets to enjoy the proteins the, that the meat provides. Nobody gets to spend thousands of dollars to uh, chase this animal. Um, it, it's the worst case scenario. You see he's got good body weight. He's probably only been in the water for a day. I don't care where you're from. I don't care what your passion is. I don't care if you're a hunter, a sportsman, or you just hate seeing animals suffer. There is absolutely nothing good about this. I've been deer hunting for 26 years, and I've never taken an animal like this. This is far bigger than anything I've ever taken. I've actively hunted for 26 years. My wife, Amy, behind the cameras, hunted for 20. She's never been able to harvest an animal of this magnitude. This is a beautiful Indiana deer. As you can see, he's got a fairly decent amount of body weight. Um, he's not bloated from the sun. So he's probably only been in the water less than a day, maybe. But that deer on the hoof probably only weighs 150, 160 pounds. Um, I'm not gonna open it, y'all see how old he is, but looking at the bottom of his feet here, they're not specifically worn and ragged. So, I mean, that deer is just reaching his prime. Us as sportsmen, us as hunters, as advocates for hunting as a as a whole, this is what we fight. We we'll always fight for the right to be able to, you know, cherish these animals. And there's nothing more nasty than what nature can do. So it's just sad. Let's, uh, let's get a hold of the conservation officer and let them know where we're